Hey folks, this is Noble Rambler. Welcome back to RimWorld where it is noon and it is foggy. So it just it looks gray like we're you know late evening, but it's the middle of the day. Anyway, so the mech attack was yesterday afternoon. The hunt was into the evening and it was midnight to 1 a.m. when we got back into here and just have two of them rehabilitating over here they've been talking to each other but um so it's, it's noon the next day i've done a few things in between episodes just to kind of progress things along alicia is going to feed michael a meal who needs it badly his mood is mood is tanking he's one of the of the break risks over here i gotta check out miss pc what's with her but um health he's still pretty rough seven to get that one fixed six more on that one three uh 12 on his on his crushed left lung ouch and right leg is orange what does that mean there's 13 over there otherwise we've got four yeah he's gonna be laid up for a while shantiku how you doing we've still got seven on your torso right arm is two right humerus is one left leg is seven that's your big injury, and right leg three. So these guys are going to be in here most of today, I'm guessing. Um, Tomislav, I think he's just getting up. Yeah, he just got up. He's getting a meal. He's going to figure out his day. Um, I did ask Handy through the morning to get this guy going because we really need geothermal power. We need power on this side. We're, we're just sucking our batteries dry right now. That They've got a leak. And they're, they're not filling up. But I got to looking at the stockpiles over here of the components and the wood and the iron and the blocks. And thought, you know, we need to just get this done and be done with it for good. So all the last of the doors that were a problem in here, the wooden doors and getting, I think it was this one or this one, this one, um, auto door. So we're auto doored through there, auto doored here so we can get in and out of this quickly. We're auto doored there. Router door out this one, and then out this one right here, as well as that. And so that, everything else is just regular granite doors, and this is done, finally. So I cleared all those out, I got blueprints in here for more of the wooden shelves, we got more of the weapons located into here. And hopefully that's not going to be a problem. Hopefully we're not going to get one bomb into here and lose everything. But that's what's up right there. And then Andy got back into working on this. So... Beyond that, is there anything real important? I got Klaus out over here demolishing everything, or deconstructing everything. So he is out here. He's got all kinds of things queued up to do. 30, maybe he's already done half of them. So oh, there was a lot, all the deconstruction going on. Um, he repaired the turrets and they're ready to be uninstalled. And then he's set last to take the battery and put it away. Otherwise, he is having a ball doing it because I guess that's all considered construction. So he's he's happy as can be. So get this thing going. I think so. Though there is, I got Eric doing the last door there. There's one other problem I came across as I was editing and I realized something just didn't look right over here. We got the new generators going to help supplement this these generators here and get these batteries charged up again. And then I got to thinking about spacing and whatnot and realized I built them into the pathway of the wind turbine. So we gained two generators to lose one. So we're going to have to disassemble them. We're going to have to mine this out and move them and rebuild them. We can't uninstall them, unfortunately. So we got to tear them down and rebuild them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, Eric, you're up there. David, what you up to? You are hauling steel to conduit. Actually, I need you to get this built. That pathway will give us a, an alternate route so we're running power out of here for today because we're going to disassemble it when we tear these generators down. Yeah. Um, anything else concerning? I don't think so. Let's do a quick roll call here. Handy's eating. She's going back to work on the generator. Uh, Rabbit, you are harvesting corn plants up in this area. Good. So we'll get this done so we can get these walls put in. Um, what was that noise? Anastasia's given birth. And Mohawk and Corazon are now part of the colony. What's going on over here? Sangri has worked on Poppy. So do that, that, that. Let's do that and that. You're obedient. And got more and make sure they're all in the kibble zone. 
which we're running low on. We got to get to the butchering, get to work on this, which is, ew. Grandma's going to bed soon, and Shantigo is in the hospital. So nobody. Hmm. So need to get that going soon. We're getting real low on kibble, and most of us sitting right over here. In fact, let's just kind of do that now before I go any further, because I'm going to forget and something's going to happen, and I hope nothing happens. I'd like a couple of episodes of, of just base building, get the kitchen moved over and get more bedrooms and start to, to start to demolish this area. That'd be nice to see some progress before winter hits and get that new uh, greenhouse area up and running. Um, I need someone to do some cooking. Let's hit cook and see who gets a thrill out of it. Grandma does and Shantico does and Michael does and they're all not going to be available today. So Klaus is busy doing other things. Miss P is going to bed. Got to figure out why she's not feeling good. Eric is constructing and I need him. Kathra is probably one of them and I would say Tomislav is one. To come up here and do some butchering and make some kibble. Uh, skills, not much. Four and five. Go any further down. I mean, we can go all the way as far as Rabbit and Sangria, but Sangria, I want working on the puppies, and Rabbit, I want you doing the work that Catherine's not doing with harvesting the last of the uh, the hay grass out there. Andy's busy doing other things. Kaya is... That could not be Cook. There we are. You get a thrill out of it, too. Okay, we'll give that a try. In which case, we'll leave Tomislav out of it. Well, we'll do the three of you for right now. I Well, take it back. Only the two, because we don't have the supplies over here. They do a lot of walking, not getting much done over there. So, who do we pull out of that? Uh, Cook, right over here. <sighs> Kathra could work on more of the plantings. Tomislav, research. It's not critical right now. And Kaya... We're good on block cutting right now. All right, so let's pull Catherine back out of it. We'll do that and get her back into growing. Okay, so with that, that takes care of that. So, Kaya, where are you right now? You are hauling a scyther blade. Let's let a... Well, you're halfway here already, sure. That'll be fine. I did get Kaya through the night. So, in between episodes, it's usually the night crew that I pester big time. Where am I? Over here. To break down the, the mechs that were already stored over here. So that's all been cleared out. The first of the scythers have been brought back in. And we got ourselves enough plasteel to pump out a couple more uh, turrets. Which I've got one set over here to build. To, to then uninstall. So we've got three again. Probably should get a fourth one going, you know. I Yeah, I think so. Let's get a fourth one going too. And get those built and we'll store four of them away. That way we can get to a little more overwhelming odds. We had, oh, yeah, we probably should have had more turrets in here to take these guys down quicker. That would have been beneficial. So eventually, we're, we're building up our, our, our wealth, our, you know, our, our ability to do things, little by little. Well, we've only been 100 episodes. What do you expect? <laughs> um, turn you on, I was as far as... Let's go to Sangria. You're working with... You're milking a cow. Okay, Kathra, you are attempting to recruit Purple. It'd be nice for Purple to join us soon. It really would. Purple is... We're talking about... It failed. Um, purple is combat. Where am I? Purple. That's what I want. Prisoner. 99%. And he is going to eke out every last one of those percents, too, isn't he? <laughs> What's your your needs look like? But it's kind of low. Moderate pain in prison feels bad. And you want a bionic body part. So that's always going to be there until we can get a hold of some kind of bionics. Which we have seen almost none of all this time. We saw a couple of claws ones. And that was about it. Really odd. David has taken off his... his What's that thing called? A Devil Strand Duster, and he's running around nothing more than a, a toque and a smile right now. Yep. Mm-hmm. What you doing? You you want to wear one of them Synthread jackets. Mm-hmm. But I thought I only had Duster on you. Oh, I ran into a problem where Michael got out of bed. This is during the night. 
and almost broke. He, he was way down in his mood, trying to get himself from that, you know, wounded and in bed over to a shield belt to put it on. I was trying to figure out why, because he's ranged. Turned out that we had two ranged categories. Ranged and one down here was another ranged. That one had everything checked as, as good. So it was apparently a mistake that I made and he somehow got switched over to it. I don't know how or when. I said I had no, he didn't go on the uh, the trip, so it had nothing to do with that. So I went ahead and reset everything that was ranged. But nope, I didn't touch the melees or the nudists. Where's David? He's a nudist melee. Edit you. All of the hats are available. I put jackets on. And jackets are... What? How is that possible? Okay, let's go back to that. Something went wrong there. David, let's reset you and see what, whoops, see what you want to do. Because you need a duster rod. So, boom, boom, and now you want to go back to your duster. Good choice. It fits you anyway. But it was really low, wasn't it? You are, no, you're only 90%. You're fine. Okay. So, minor break risk, Kaya, who really wants to wear a pigskin duster. <laughs> oh, they're swapping clothes right now. But, um, needs. You are getting kind of low, and I'm going to have you butchering in this ugly place over here. Well, we'll see how that works. Let's have the first thing you do, do some cleaning. And then you should drop into, um, into butchering on your own. Thinking about too many things at once. Klaus, you are up in here. How you doing? You're still getting there. Okay, so... We'll, Miss P went to bed. Alicia, what are you up to? You are cleaning dirt. So I got Alicia and... Well, I had Tomislav on cleaning duty, but now it's just Alicia. Uh, lights are going off. What happened over here? He tore it down, but he didn't finish over here. Okay, David, where are you at? You are over there, relaxing socially. Needs... Ah, Eric, where are you at? You're in better shape. But you're all the way out over here. Repairing a sandbag. Ah, you're on repair mode. Yeah, um, I can eliminate that. Well, where'd Klaus go? You're up there. Okay. Eric, let's have you instead take over some of this work for Klaus. Let's have you deconstruct that one, that one, that one. And I don't think he got into these yet. Do that. Yeah, you can repair the one. That one's going to stay anyway. So you picked the right one to repair. And these are going to stay. So we're going to hang on to this little corner right here. That kind of worked in case we're up against something else in this area. Um, though Tony brought up in the comments if I had had Klaus over here the whole time these guys were jumping in and out, that would have been better. And in hindsight, yeah, I didn't see it at the time. You know, Klaus occasionally got off a shot but not many because the longer time for the sniper but over here he could have just kept shooting i didn't i just didn't think of it of course the next episode he was down in here so he was able to shoot continuously but um hang on to that corner and a couple of just strategic corners like that one that one this one both sides of this and the corner of this building i think those would be good spots for us or going after whatever works into this area. Maybe a siege that comes down and sets up and give us a place to, to aim from. So that's future-proofing this area. But I need David to pass on his social. Is there anybody else in the area that can construct? Um, Handy, you're way up there. Uh, Klaus is way up there. And as far as construction skills, Kaya has some. She's down in here right now, and she's getting ready to break. Cleaning blood. Didn't I just ask you to do it over there, and that's it? Oh, you're still moving toward that because you went and got your, your pigskin jacket on. Okay. So, David, yep, I need you. Come up here and finish the job. I asked you originally to put in this conduit, and you filled it in and did the other job. So, come up here and do this one and then do this one get us up and running again then I guess switch this guy back on David and get us nope don't do that we'll immediately let's let's find out if 
the solar panel power is enough to get us up and running again without any batteries let alone enough to uh, start to fill us up it's probably not you got them both okay so because we don't have any wind power to add to it how are we doing zero one two we do have enough to fill up a little bit not as much well it's foggy yeah, but we're still 100 percent here so we're still making 1700 watts okay so enough sun is getting through the cloud layer okay that works um we do need to get these things built then and who would be the one to do that alicia you are cleaning but let's get you to right here punch these out so we can get the other ones built today emergency mode so that through the night we can be recharging this system all right um so kaya you are butchering and needs how are you doing you're still dropping you cleaned up the area but you do get a thrill out of cooking do i have to wait for you to actually start chopping on that that deer to get a joy boost well comfort's going up you like the chair there's a tiny bit of joy boost and it's done so this isn't going to work for you it's not we're just dropping further and further and you're going to randomly break okay so let's get you to stop right there and let's grab a meal and let's take you off of cooking uh kaya everything changed on me you're down there now cooking right there back to a two and let's do what for you back to crafting which would be block cutting even though we have plenty let's kick this up one more notch bills and oh we well okay we've got enough to keep you going for a while we're gonna be calling for a lot of them soon but yeah your meal then you'll automatically go to that one i'm pretty sure i may have to assign you though crafting is also up here so that may or may not work um handy how you doing where are you by the way you are going after five. <laughs> yeah that's a problem so let's kind of collect all this stuff she's going to collect what is that 17 and then she's going to leave yeah so let's haul all these let's put all these together then pick them all up at once Oh, good. You are going to make the trip. Oh, good. So we're at 38, 47, right there. Oh, good. You're wandering all the way up into there. 70, almost finished it off. Okay, 75, and let's do this. So instead, actually, no, handy, clear all that, and work on this, and then work on, clear it and work on this was that enough to get you to drop it and then pick it up again where are you there you go all right you're set gotta do a little bit of babysitting Tomislav, you are making kibble thank you and that means Kathra could do some because kaya's not going to work out Kathra, let's have you work and we're still in the cooking order you're there and Kathra, break, break, and butchering. Good. Go grab that, and let's get this out of cooking. And backwards on cooking, and now we're alphabetical. Good. All right. So what I'm hoping to do, I'm hoping to not have another raid for a little while. I hope the game gives us a little bit of a break. Get kind of done up in here, cleaned up, hauled away, and he's ready to make another one of her fateful trips hmm. and then get that up and running and a perimeter put in and maybe get this guy functioning then get down into here and get the kitchen working so we can move the food over and be done with this and then start working our way through some of the bedrooms and start demolishing this that's my plan where'd handy go you went there and back already with 17 we got to come up with another plan yeah that's just this is still the closest stuff, I'll bet. That one right there. You're going to go for four next time, aren't you? Right there. And you're off for the five. Oh, I didn't see that one. Yeah, five. You're going to come back with nine. 
How do we shortchange that? I guess, how many do you need left? You still need another 75 would do it. Okay, let's do this. Andy, if you're going to assist on going up here, come over here and haul. Well, i got to get you to do a little bit of cleaning, though. Let's haul these. Oh, there's 75 there? Ooh, that's a good haul right there. Okay. Let's get you to there, and then tell you to go back and work on that again. Then we should have power up and running by nighttime. Well, that's a big project, and it's 1,900 hours. Your food is making it, but your rest is bad. Meaning... You burnt here in this battle, went to the hospital. Let's stop right there. And let's get you to do that. And spent the day in the hospital bed. And then you got up in the night and started doing all this stuff. So, and all this stuff. So you're ready to go to bed now. You're, you're past due. Needs, you're way past due. Okay, I'm going to drop that off, then I'm going to break you. And you'll go and... Get a meal. Maybe so. Rotten's gotten or rotten. Rabbit has gotten rotten food poisoning. Okay. Berries. So he had berries. Why did wonder why he had berries instead of going down there to get a meal? I guess because they count as a meal. Okay, handy, you are now needing what? One steel left. Okay, handy, you're cleared. Let's go to bed. Uh go grab a meal just so that that is done. And we're really low on meals grandma's up whoo we made it and Kathra is butchering there's only there's no meat we butchered all those deer there's some kibble now but there's no meat oh the constant battle for meat in this game this winter is going to kill us it is. Wow. And, well, we still have some. I guess next episode we, we do another hunt. Hopefully it won't be as uh, wild and crazy as the last one. Looking for some nearby herds. I'm not seeing any. You know, we got those, what, felt like four or five event herds running through the place. We haven't seen any since. Is that like a winter thing? What time of year was that? And we're out of power again. We are out of power again because these are down. Okay, we got to get this flick, this flick switched. There we go. Got to do that. Who is Alicia? And you are back to cleaning. Let's get you to do that, Alicia. And David and Eric. Eric needs your food and rest are not that bad. David, you're flip flop, but you're both not that bad. Let's get these things in and get them built, hopefully tonight. So build me a copy of that one, and build me a copy of that one, and let's run power straight across the top of them, just to make sure it works. And we're good. Let's check this guy. He's out of their range now. All right, Eric, you are building a marble floor, probably down at the prison. Come out here and tackle this one. And David, you are building a granite wall somewhere. Where are you at? You're down in here. Eric must be right. That's Klaus. Klaus is down here too. Oh, Klaus has got a much faster building speed. You are in decent shape too. Klaus, you take over this one. You'll, it'll get it done even faster. So pop in here and do that one. All right, that works out good. Now, what is there for David to do that's more important than down there? Anything? Got the batteries built last time. Um, kind of looking around for important projects. I got this set to make sure we don't collapse, but we're going to have to go a long way before we're ready to collapse, so I don't think I need to worry about that right now. Um, this get done. Think about that. Conduit. That's not conduit right there. Shantigo's healed. Build copy. Yep. No, it isn't. I need... That's right, I noticed that before. We're missing that one piece of conduit right there, and this never connected. So... Oh, I know what I need them to be doing. David, you can get to work up here. Why don't you get this guy running? There we go. And then I do need to get that conduit in, though. Who could do that? Kaya. 
Whatever happened with you? You're back in better shape. You're playing chess right now. Your joy's pretty good. Go ahead and do just that one conduit. You've got the good construction skill, right? Eight, yeah. So you can do that. All right, that's a plan. And so David, you're running up there with that one piece of steel, and then you gotta go find eight components somewhere. Then you'll probably go to bed. So we'll get that going. Batteries, it should charge back up through the night. 286, 287, 288, slowly, but it should get some charge through the night. Over here, we're running on this bank only. We've got to get these built. So Klaus is already constructing. Oh, good. What happened to Eric? Eric went to bed. <laughs> so Klaus, yeah, i got to do it to you. I need this one built next. It's a shame because Eric was assigned to it, so he didn't bring the extra components or anything to, to deal with that. Okay. Who can fill this, though? Kaya, you're resting. Needs. I'm going to leave you alone. You're right on that border right now. Who else is moving around in this area? Shantigo, you're up. There you are. You are wearing a beaver skin t-shirt. And now you're consuming a fine meal. Yep. And otherwise your rest is decent. You can then fill this up. <clears throat> then you can fill this up. Then you can get to, to working. And yet we are pretty much out of meat again. We've got enough for a few meals to get it stocked up. And we're going to be done again. Oh, that's that's a little frustrating. We could go back to simple meals. The, the five bonus for a fine meal has sure been nice. But we do have plenty of capacity here for, for meals that don't involve meat. Mm. It might be wise just to get 20 of those set back on again. 30. Let's take you down to 20. Backup plan. Okay. Do that. Power. I think it's on where it's supposed to be. These just haven't turned on yet. Okay. So Klaus is doing that. Anything else for him to do? I don't think so. But you could do this real quick before you go to bed because you're right here. Yeah, there you go. Get that one going, and let's do that again. Just make sure it gets done. So this one got f maxed out. It did. All right, so just a few more logs. Get that one finished. You know, a whole bunch more logs. Okay, so that's ready to go. Do we have any positive power yet? We still do not. Wow. We really depend on these solar generators. Yeah. <sighs> Is there anything more we can shut down? We're cold out. We're 22 degrees outside. Bedrooms are 58. We need to be using the, the heaters right now. So we can't be shutting any of those down. We could shut down research. Yeah, I guess so. Shut you down and you down. There's some power. Natalia, I hate to bug you, but you could do that and... Did that not work? Designate. I guess I hit the wrong one. And then you can do that one. Then what? Uh, Natalia, it would be nice if you would go up and work on the, uh, the, the smelting up there. That one and that one. Okay, let's have you... If I send you up here... You got food? You got food. If I send you up here to do this... And then unprioritized you, would you stay... That's what I'm curious about. Grandma, you are consuming a fine meal. And then if I had you butcher, would you go off and find things off in the distance? David, where you been? Oh, you've been working up in there. Now you're going for components. Let's let you go to bed. Carrying a fine meal, cook, or eating a fine meal. Yeah, you need... Now well, you need to go to bed so you can wake up with everyone else. No, wait a minute here. I thought about switching, David. Did I do it? Um, restrict. I did. I thought, I got to thinking after last episode, I was going to bring it up this one, and I haven't I remembered to yet, but he would be good for the night crew, along with a good cook, so a good constructor, a good cook, a good doctor, and then a couple of miners to do mining work during the night. So I'm going to transition David into the night crew and see just how that goes. 
having him available for raids during the day hasn't done any good because he just he's a, I think it's still a one on both ranged and melee. Oh, two on melee now. So he's he's thump thumped a turkey or two, but it's not really as much of an advantage to us during raids. So the idea of being able to head out there with the main group hasn't really uh, played out. So I think, yeah, his plan is to hang around up in here. So he's going to attempt to recruit Purple. Um, and there is that. That gives us a nighttime warden. Purple um, needs. You're good. You fed. All right, do that. And when you're done recruiting Purple, uh, David, yeah, then come back here and get this working through the night. So after that, you do that. All right, that's your plan. And Sea Stars, you are working in here, which is a good thing. Let's get this room going so we can get the research bench and the, the other stuff over into this area. So I cannot shut down the comms console because we won't get a message that we've got someone that really wants to buy all of our extra pigs. So I've got to keep that one running. Um, we still don't have any power charging. Okay. Is there anything else that could be shut down that's not truly needed besides lights? Lights I want to keep running. Well, it'd be nice to. It makes the video look better. Let's put it that way. Um, think about big ticket items. And what would they be? You are 350. We're not using you at the moment. Let's uh, do that. Eric, you are building a granite wall. Why? You just got up. It's four in the morning and you're starting your shift. Come over here and flick that switch. We can turn on as we need it. Now, anything else? Anything else? These are running right now and they don't need to be. There we go. That's that's a biggie right there. Who's in this area is moving around? Alicia, you're up for the day? You're up for the day. Good. When you're done, Miss B's got it. Miss B, where are you? You're all the way down over here. They're going to run all the way up there to take care of that. That's why I manually set people to flick the switch. It just doesn't work to let the game think for itself sometimes. So when you're done, you're going to do that one and that one. Sea Stars was going to dive all the way out of her job to go and flick that switch. So now you're going to go take care of that. Okay. So the steel ran out. It was all in that area. I see. That's done, and this is all done. So I got to get these set back in too. So fill that back in, and then we'll go. Actually, I'll have to cancel you. I'd like to get somebody to. In fact, Eric, you can do that. You are building a granite wall. Let's build this one instead. Work on granite wall. So these got done. They're up and running. David's going to take care of this one. Get that up and running. I need someone to take down these trees so we can get a protective wall around it. So who would that be? Miss B proved to be not very good at it the last time we checked. I need growers, which is probably Rabbit and Cathra, which have what to do right now. That's probably not going to make it, 53%. Same thing over here. You are 88%. That's possible this stuff is still going to harvest. Okay. Outdoor stuff. You guys were planted. Mail 56. You made it this far. That's impressive. And... Tomislav, you're way over here. Hmm. Maybe I'd have to turn these guys off for a while. I can't. You can't. Well, I can do this. I can do that. Let's let him get closer. Right there. And let's turn this guy off too. Are these both the same thing? You're venison or you're venison. Tomislav, haul these away. Um, haul this one too. Ah, reserved by. Good. Bring those back. And you come over here and work over in this area. But kibble, no more kibble. Let's just turn that off. So work and uh, cook and turn off two and two. No more kibble. Let's save it for uh, save it for food. Save it for meals. So dog loving going on in there. So both you guys are going to draft and undraft. And go off and do your own things. Grab something to eat and go off and, and do your own stuff. What's happening over here? While birth gave, uh, while boar gave birth. Good. Eric, I wanted that one done. Perfect. So give me another one right there. 
and you're going to build yourself in, aren't you? <laughs> okay, let's... Um, I wonder if there's any in the area. What are you doing? You're consuming a fine meal. So after that, come in and do that one. Okay. Sea stars doing fine. Yep, that's going to be a wall there. Remember what's, what's happening here. And actually, let's take down these two. All the way to... All the way to there. That's what needs to be done. Okay, we'll rebuild these walls. All right, with that, well, whatever happened to Natalia, you are still over here. So, break, and you are done. You're out of here. Okay, that's fine. We got, how much did we get done through the night? We got four of them done, so we got 40 more steel out of that. Um, you're on this power side. Still getting low, but we're still holding. Should be enough. Hello, for this to get done. So batteries are dropping. We're not connected. We're not connected. There, that could not have been. So we're not connected. So what do we need? We need to take a tree down. The pathway goes that way and connects. Let's see this pathway again. I set it up so I could all, I could use one of these pathways for the power in here. Um, conduit is probably the easiest way to do that. So that doesn't help me much at all. Let's stare at this a little bit. Power goes through here, goes across, and it breaks all through there. No, that's the wall. And it connects and goes down. And then we hit a switch. We run through this wall and... We don't need any of that. This switch only runs these. So in that case, um, oh, that's going to be tough. I can't just kill the conduit. I've got to kill... Okay, I can do this way. C. Yeah, none of this needs to be here. We can stop right below this light here. Right there. In fact, let's put that one back in. Right there. Okay. So that will grab from there. Power's going to go across here instead. So I've got to get that tree, that tree, that tree, that tree done. And then all this conduit in. All right. So I need tree cutters. I need rabbit. He is sleeping. Needs. He's done sleeping. Okay. Rabbit, grab a meal. And wow. Our last two meals. I need a Shantigo. Shantigo is up and running again. Okay. I need this to be a little more efficient. Is Churchill really eating one of our meals? Shantigo, grab that meal. Um, right now. What? You, what? you won't do it. You? Shantigo, right click. Prioritize hauling. Reserved by. Take it out from under him. I think he ate it. Okay, so with that, I want you to... You, I can't haul into this space. Can I now? No. So I can't get that loaded with venison. Still can't. <laughs> Let's haul that. And then maybe I can. Nope, can't do it. Okay, you're just going to have to do it five at a time. Anyway, we're we're hurting on meat again. But you'll go to Simple Meals, and we're just going to have to live with those now. Okay. Um, Cathra. Rabbit. Let's go with Rabbit first. Rabbit, once you do that, I want you to get up here and take out um, that one. Cathra, where are you? Um, right here. You are clear on this side. Okay. And you're replanting. Which would be nice, but this is kind of important, and with your good growing skill, I'm assuming you're going to take these trees down quite fast. So let's um, cut oak tree. There, there, there. And the rest of it is not as critical. Though all the oak trees in this area to get these blocks, these walls built, are critical. So let's do that. Didn't check your food. Okay, you're good for a while. So we're up to there. Let's get this one done. At least all the inner ones. So we can get one layer going in here. 
Um, that door is going to be important, and that one. All right, we'll just go through that mess right there. Okay, and that's going to get some wood back into the uh, into the area. So the mark, but I've got nobody set directly to cutting because we have way too many jobs to do and way too few. Even with this big line right here, there's so much for them to do. I really need two handlers, and you can see how far behind we are on on all of the uh, the the green check marks here. So there's no way the Sanger can do all this alone. But who do you grab to do it? They're all busy doing three other things. That's that's RimWorld. What's going on over in here? Okay, Eric and David don't need well, kind of need it, and I kind of need so many other things going on. Let's think about this. We got power starting to build in here again. Okay, which means this is building as well. Michael's fully healed. Oh, good. Got more hands in here. Michael is removing his shirt. <laughs> I need to get somebody ah <sighs> build and making clothes. Kaya. What have you got here? Character. Crafting in general. But you don't get pleasure out of it. And that's a problem. Though you, What's the beauty over here? You don't get pleasure out of block cutting either. And yet you do, you do well with it. So over here, beauty is 2.6. It's even better. Okay. Well, maybe you're going to be a seamstress for a while. Let's go that route. So right now you're doing what? Kaya, you are block cutting. Okay. Uh, work. And right there, let's turn you on to tailoring and see how well you do with that. Uh, there, give me a, just a space, there we go. So you're down here, as soon as you finish with that block, you run up and start making shirts. And because everyone's swapping out and I know they're dumping off low quality stuff and there aren't that many good or new shirts available. So that's gonna be a problem soon. Now, I'm assuming that Klaus finished all that was supposed to be done over here. He did. Is this stuff deteriorating? It doesn't say anything about not being under a roof. So I can leave you guys there. I don't like leaving you guys there because I want the... Uh, um, deter that's deteriorating. Because I want the stuff available. Deteriorating. we got to get these things in. Um, assign animals, pigs... Over here, you guys are in the wild boar area. You are there. It's just there's a thousand other things to haul too. Yeah. Um, Michael doesn't haul. And I can't con him into any of these, can I? What's your... You know, you don't have a crafting skill. You're a three or, or something. So having you craft these into plasteel, maybe not the best idea to get you to haul them. Um... Kathra, you are busy cutting trees. Sangria already has too many animals to work on as it is. Alicia is cleaning dirt. Alicia, come up and haul a plasteel turret. Eric, you are relaxing socially and you kind of need it. David, you are resting because it's you're, you're, you're on night shift now. Grandma is resting. She's on night shift. Kaya is attempting to recruit purple and she could do it too she's an 11 okay it's one of the first times i haven't had her call us her gathering to celebrate klaus and sangria's marriage Ooh. okay we finally have a something uh interesting to uh to end the episode with all right that's good so but just like a party, let's make sure they've got some food in them. There's no food. There's no food. <laughs> Why is there no food? We're really... Because I have the animals still set to eat from the fridge. But I don't have them set to eat from the food, the, the, the meal area. It was only right in there. Is that right? Let me think about that. I thought about that one I... I had no kibble. Did I actually do it though? Um, I did not. No. Okay. Never mind. Never mind. That was a thought and a plan, and then I shut the game down to work on it again today for this episode, and I did not get back to that. I thought about, you know, one time we ran out of kibble and we started starving animals, and afterward, in hindsight, I was thinking, you know, I could have just let them have like this area right here. All, all of them. And they all could have come down and grabbed what they needed and left. So that's something I want to keep as a backup plan. So, wow. 
It just blows me away that there's so few meals. There's five sitting right there. Anyway, Tomasov, are you starving? Who's starving? Because they're not going to eat for the entire wedding. And then they're going to have all kinds of mood problems. All right, you're fine. Michael is cloud watching. Let's get you to grab one of these meals. And Miss P, you're fine. Alicia, Eric, David is going to need one too. Even though he's resting, we're going to get him up for the wedding. Grandma is going to need one also. And then Sea Stars is fine and Kaya is fine. So everybody else, I need to break so they can... Let's see, what is that? That's RR. There we go. So they can go to the wedding. Handy. Relaxing socially. Right there. You guys are all going to get a huge bonus from the wedding. Attending a wedding. Shantigo cooking a fine meal afterwards. I think you will break automatically to attend the wedding. Klaus, cloud watching. Why don't you go do that? Sangria. Milking boom up four. You're quite a ways away. Let's get you going. Kathra, you are harvesting an oak tree. Ouch. Well, next episode, or probably after this episode, I'll spend some time getting the rest of that stuff chopped up there and um, maybe get a perimeter wall, at least materials laid out. Resting, that is Natalia. Break and attending. Okay. Michael, you are consuming, then you're going to automatically do it. Miss P, go to the wedding. Alicia, hauling turret. Well, you're not going to get here any faster than if you just hauled it in anyway. So when you finish hauling it, you should automatically go to the wedding. Eric, you are... Actually, Alicia, where are you? You're still here. Okay. Break. Go to the wedding. All right. Eric, you... Same thing. David, let's see. That was RR. You're eating. Grandma, eating. Sea stars, sleeping. Not anymore. Kaya. Uh, recruiting purple. How far did you get? You are doing it. So when you're done you will go to the, the wedding. We're shaking hands. Let's watch Kaya work her magic. She was last in here. She was with Purple. They they know each other. Yeah. Oh, oh, that looks really good. That's shaking hands and uh-huh, uh-huh. He's pacing back and forth. He's like, recruit failed. 0.67% chance. That's rough. Okay, you going to the wedding? You're going to the wedding. All right, let's go over to the wedding. Klaus and Sangria. And a muffalo has given birth to... Oh, Andy just told off... No, Natalia just told off someone. <laughs> um, social. No. Who? Miss P? Shantigo was insulted insulted by sea stars. That's what it was. We're going to have a brawl for, for uh, Klaus and Sangria's wedding here. And we've got to give them a wedding bed. Mmm... Yeah, Klaus, you should build yours, build that wedding bed, but we have nowhere to place you. We don't. Hmm. I guess temporarily it's over here until we get built in there. This is a slightly bigger space. I guess that's what it's going to have to be. So double bed and... Something fancy. Tell you what, let's just go with wood for now, and we'll rebuild that later. Wood's actually, I think it's considered the most comfortable, so they get a better sleep out of it. It's not the most beautiful. You get a more a higher wealth rating and other ratings from the other beds, but we'll go with that one. So when Klaus is done, he gets to uh, he gets to go do this. Um, back over there. Did he make it here? Klaus, where is your name? There you are. And Sangria. There you are. Okay, they're both in there. In their in their you know their their wedding outfits. Yeah. Too bad the game didn't doesn't do a, a, a Sims and have them spin around and show up in a tuxedo and a in a gown and then oh these didn't get planted. Can I get the growers? Handy, can you sew? And Catherine, are you here? Kathra, don't see the name. Where you at? You're over here. I want you to sew this one. And rabbit, you here? You're there. You can sew that one. And who else can plant? Who's good at it? Thomas Lob was pretty good at it, right? Grow. 
Kethra Sangria is good at it. Should I make her do it? On Alicia, she can do it. She's a good grower. That's right. So I want Alicia to find you this way. Where are you? You're right there. And you're right there. You plant that one. All right, you guys all put those in real quick. And you can just go right back to your to your relaxing socially and attending a wedding ceremony. Yeah. Now we have some flowers for the wedding. That's good. I don't think I'll make someone build those last three chairs. Klaus and Sangri are beginning their marriage ceremony. Eric, what you doing? <laughs> Maybe he's going to officiate it. Oh, sorry. I'm, okay. <laughs> there we go. Exchanging their vows. There hasn't been a brawl. It's, it's going to be a good one. Yeah, looking deep into each other's eyes with their, their helmets on. <laughs> Does look like he's got a bow tie there, though. That's nice. It's it, it's a long ceremony. We'll do some creative zooming out. Then we'll zoom back in. And... Okay, this is taking forever. There we go. <laughs> Colonists are now celebrate the occasion. Great. So they're going to get a boost in here. We'll hang around long enough to see if... That was a long pause. I don't like those long pauses. Bad things usually come out of that. 24 hours. What does that mean? That's 23 days. 24 H. Hmm. See right there. 24H, but over here I get something a lot more. Let's let's pop into that and see what that is real quick. So item stash opportunity. Wally, chief of the Ron of the River, has informed us of a collection of valuable items. An infinite chem reactor. An infinite chem reactor. Is that a power source? Power source. Power source. That's something I've forgotten all about. If we were to research up to the the reactor for the, the ship, we could use that as a power source. And it seems like it was a very significant one. One that could take the place of one of these guys and get quite a bit of, of power for this side of the river. Ooh, but what is the infinite chem reactor? Oh, it's right down here. Slowly generates chem fuel by a complex series of chemical reactions using atoms extracted from the air. Cool. It's a boomalope. But I'm thinking about that ship reactor. Hmm. Let's keep that one on our long-term plans too. Um, won't last. We have 23 days to do it. Beware. Valuables tend to be tend to attract danger. <clears throat> Accept, reject, and postpone. Let's postpone it. Look at it real quick. I really don't want to go make another trip. I want to get more of this base built. I don't want the distraction. I want to get the, the kitchen up and running. I want to get everyone into their own bedroom. I want to get the rec room built and all of, you know, the, the floors smooth. And there's so much work. And, oh, I was thinking it's on top of us. No, it's going to be, boy, you're not it. It didn't give us a location. There's a joy wire stashed over there. There's an AI Persona core over there. It's nowhere nearby that it's going to show me. Maybe I have to accept it in order to see it. So I'm just going to leave that floating. I don't know where to go back to it. I'll leave that there. Maybe that... Yeah, that stayed there on its own. Okay. So I'm guessing we can't see where it is until we accept it. Because it shouldn't be further than what we can see here and I just don't see it okay so with that let's let this run for a little bit longer see if we have a brawl or something and hopefully we don't let's let's keep this civil guys and we'll move on from here but what kind of boost are we getting sangria should have a huge boost 50 for marrying Klaus and need some food honeymoon phase tears it tons of joy opinion of my husband yeah a boar's given birth Muffalo, was it a Muffalo that gave birth before? Whatever the other pop-up was. Um, Klaus, you'll have the same sort of thing. Let's see someone like Catherine. 20. So everyone's going to get a plus 20. And she sowed plants today. 
and they're all going to go eat raw food and get food poisoning because they're all going to be hungry after this and there's nothing to eat so simple meals need to go on work frenzy is tomislav and with that i think i better call this one done it's been noble rambler thanks for watching guys and i'll catch you later Bye bye